Hi, this is Paul from Wave5Trade.com. Today is Monday the 26th of March and this is my daily video. A look at one of our stock signals from our membership service on Wave5Trade.com. And today I'm going to look at shorts. But briefly, our members in the stock signal area um, get both long and on short potential trades on weekly, daily and 60 minute time frames. So, and they're downloadable as a spreadsheet every single day. So for the 26th of March here, you can see all the other archives down there um, for each result for the scanners every day for potential fifth wave trades. So simply click on the image there and it downloads a spreadsheet. So let's have a look at the spreadsheet, quick example, before we go to the charts. So for the 26th of March, these are the results for potential shorts on the weekly time frame. Now, the reason why I've chosen weekly uh, time frame is that there's a lot of volatility at the moment, and I just want to iron out some of that volatility and go longer term. So I'm looking for a longer term short, and I've chosen AAP today. So let's have a look at the chart. Okay, so I'm using the wave5trade.com Elliott Wave Indicator Suite for the Trade Station platform, but it also is available for Think or Swim, Ninja Trader, and Multichart platforms. It behaves the same way, uh, just looks a little different because each platform is different. So for our members, uh, we need to look and get out of this rangey period first before we get the bearish move on the weekly time frame. So our isolating the Elliott Wave count is just before this bearish move down here. Then our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite automatically uh, gives us the Wave 1, the 2, the 3 and the 4. That's all automatic there. Also, when we look at the filters for the scanner results for the membership, we have the 535 oscillator down the bottom pulling back between 90 and 140% here within our parameters. The stochastics also crossed over in the overbought zone and the wave force pulled back into our high probability uh, zones there for resistance to turn back down. So let's have a closer look. So very simply, the filter on the membership service has already given us a start, a good starting point. We can see that the wave force pulled back into the amber zone. Now that's an 80% probability. It's going to go on and make a new wave 5 low into our automated target zones down here in blue. And the target zone is reasonably thick, but we can see there we've got a risk to reward from our stop loss to entry, but the minimum of 1 to 1.6 and maximum just around about 1.2. So a great risk to reward for a, quite a conservative entry here. So we're going to put the stop loss about 15 cents above the wave for high here. Now, this is because it's quite an expensive stock and we just need a little bit of a gap between the wave for high and our stop loss. The entry is at 102.85. So it's way outside the 6.4 moving average low here. Now, this moving average low is part of the Elliott Wave Indicator Suite and it gives us conservative entry strategies. But I want to make sure that we have a weekly bar close below this but also below these two pivot levels here, because these were rejections on previous moves down, if we have a closer look. So we want to make sure we are below that support level. So 102.85 entry short on the weekly time frame for AAP seems quite sensible to me. A very, very simple setup from our stock signal service using our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite for the trade station version this time. As an example, uh, very, very long term uh, short. So we're talking maybe nine, uh, anything up to 16 weeks short here. So it's a longer term short, um, but looks very, very good. Overall, this AAP stock is in a longer term bearish trend. Yes, it's had a recent bullish move, but that's just a pullback against the main trend. Now it's found good resistance. It's found resistance in our probability zones. It is most likely to turn back down again. So simply short entry 102.85 down short on AAP. So that's it for today. Have a great training day and I'll speak to you all tomorrow.